Hello! My name is Odysseus Prometheus III, and welcome back to the Beginner's Guide. So yeah, from now on, I think I'm just going to do two chapters a game, two chapters an episode, because those seem to be about the length that I need to go. Hmm. Okay. Stage. Nice chairs. Okay. Well, ah, it's just a big black screen. Okay. Okay. Um. Wait a second. Did I just like walk through the? Yeah, I can just walk through these. Well, not all of them apparently, or maybe I can. I. Let's just walk around this stage for a little bit. Can I walk through anything else? Doesn't look like I can. Can I continue walking? Yeah. So, I guess the boxes weren't technically fully implemented. Or at least not all of them. Okay. So we're on the stage now. Ooh. The stage... This was in the trailer. All right, the performance is beginning. Places, please. Uh, we are gathered. We are at a gathering of professionals. First, you'll start out leaning against this wall. Good. Stay right there. Woman across the room in this chair. Professional photographer of animals. If you dream to photograph animals professionally, this is your one chance to learn something from her, to gain something, to succeed. Go on, say something to her. Where is the bathroom? <laughs> what are you doing? You're deflecting. Not saying what's actually on your mind. Stop dancing around it. Have a conversation with this person. Do it again. I'm super scared right now. I like you. You're all of my hopes and dreams. Yes. You're all of my hopes and dreams. No, no, no. It's not I'm, what I said to her at all. Complete, completely missing the tone of the conversation. I was reserved, but I knew what I wanted. I was confident. For some reason, I was just that one moment, but I was confident. Maybe it's a better feeling sitting a lot of people around us. I'll give you some props to work with. These cones that bounce when you touch them will represent people nearby. Now talk to her again. Can I, I can move. Well. Can I get stuck between two? Can I get stuck between two? Yeah. I'm like a pinball. Anyway. You must have worked really hard to get where you are. I'll bet you learn to lean into the pain. What are some sacrifices you've had to make? One. Messing it all up again. Freak her out if the conversation gets personal too quickly. Do you realize how important this was for me? I'll never get another... I didn't read the last thing. Hmm. To try something. Try stepping back from the stage. Oh. Oh, um. Do I just... No. Oh. Prison again. Do I just keep walking? Oh. Okay, yes. The game no. ends with this eerie premonition of what's going to happen next in Coda's life. The solution to social anxiety, to fears of having to perform and having to chase success, the answer for Coda is to withdraw, to hide himself away. Which is what leads to scenarios like the stairs that slowed you down several games ago, where it just becomes harder and harder to access Coda's inner landscape because he keeps retreating. He just keeps backing away from possible connections to anyone other than himself. And to be honest, I didn't consider it very healthy when I first played this game. 
you know, it, it looks to me like he was trying to justify the idea of just disconnecting yourself from the world. And that wasn't what I wanted for him or for his games. Because I feel like a lot of his games are inviting me. Eerie premonition of what's going to happen next in Coda's life. The solution to social anxiety, to fears of having to perform and having to chase success, the answer for Coda is to withdraw, to hide himself away, which is what leads to scenarios like the stairs that slowed you down several games ago, where it just becomes harder and harder to access Coda's inner landscape because he keeps retreating. He just keeps backing away from possible connections to anyone other than himself. And to be honest, I didn't consider it very healthy when I first played this game. You know, it, it looked to me like he was trying to justify the idea of just disconnecting yourself from the world. And that wasn't what I wanted for him or for his games. Because I feel like a lot of his games are inviting me to connect. To connect with this person. To bring him closer. Okay. Is that all? Oh, good. I think it- But what can you do? After this, Koda went off and took another five months to make a new game. Okay. Okay. So, we finally got through that. Mobius trip. Improperly. Must keep your eyes closed. Quick to begin the game. Okay, since so little has happened so far, I will finish this. Captain, what can we do? What's going on? I'm gonna do help, I'm blind, I can't see anything, what's going on? Please, someone talk to me, tell me how to solve this. Oh, God, it's the door. You should probably open your eyes if you haven't already. It's pretty much impossible to solve otherwise. And there is a solution, by the way. Found the dots. Okay. Three. What's going on? I don't know what to do. Do I go through this door over here? Or elevator, I guess. There you go. I can't keep making these. Yes, that's it. That's the truth. Like I said, I was getting concerned. First off, he's never been this explicit in his work about exactly what he's thinking. So, where's that coming from? But then, even weirder, his work has potentially stopped being an outlet for him. Not like he's having trouble iterating on ideas, but he literally just can't think of new ideas anymore. And in person, he was being a lot more distant than usual. Like, you know how sometimes a person will just deflect anything that you say in order to keep themselves disconnected all the time? It was that kind of thing. Here was the point in my relationship with Coda where I really started to wonder if he needed my help in some way. Okay, before I continue going through this, I just want to point out SS Whisper. Anyway, like audibly pointed out, I looked at it for like a solid 30 seconds.
His games are going to get more desperate from here on out. After this game, it's almost six months before he finishes something new. Okay. I'm going to end the episode here. Um, yeah. So, if you guys haven't noticed, the tone of everything has really changed along with me. Like, I went into this game thinking it would be hilarious and witty and things such as that, but it is getting heavy fast. I mean, jeez. Okay. I'm going to end the episode here. My name is Odysseus Prometheus III, but you can call me Odie. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Hey, 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 you should subscribe.